guys, it is finally time to declutter my closet and I'm very excited about this one because I feel like my style is changing a lot and I really want to try and sell some things. I've had a lot of luck selling things on Mercari, so I'm looking to do that in the future. My drawers are full of casual clothes and workout clothes, which I have a lot of and I don't use enough of it. So first I want to tackle the dresser that is in front of me right now. So this dresser has a bunch of workout clothes and I really need to go through lots of stuff. This is what I'm working with and I'm going to go through and put into here what I'm going to sell. unsuccessful. Hopefully this is better. In the second drawer we have more workout clothes, um, things that I really like. So I, I don't see myself getting rid of this because it's in this drawer for a reason. Let me just double check. So I just cut some wallpaper and put it inside of the drawer and it looks so cute. I got this wallpaper for $3, like a full brand new roll and I thought it would be perfect and it is. So I've tackled the dresser pretty well. Now I'm gonna move on to this and I've had this for a very long time and I wish that I didn't have clothes in it because this actually stores bras, bralettes and extra socks and then the bottom is a bunch of t-shirts, fandom t-shirts that I probably won't wear so I should try to sell it or if Michael wants them, who knows. So I'm gonna go through this and hopefully I'll have a lot less stuff and I won't have to put anything in here because I'm trying to have a designated bra drawer in this chest right here. So now that I'm done with the dresser, it's time to move on to the closet, which is actually where I want the biggest transformation to happen because there's quite a lot of stuff in here that I feel like I don't want and I don't wear and it just sits in here. So yeah, I'm gonna go over like the sections that I've made first so you guys can overview. So here we have the closet and as you can see, there's plenty of space. And on the back wall, I have storage and hangers up there and I have some more like fun pants and some joggers and sweatpants and some heavy duty sweaters that need to be put away. And this bag is summer clothes, so I'm gonna go through that later. To the left, up top, I have some bed linen, so we're not gonna go through that. And down below on this shelf are all of my sweaters. Here I have some like sweatshirt, oh, and one pair of sweatpants. So yeah, I want all of my casual clothes to go in the dresser out there and then this to be like my nice closet. We'll see if I can do that. On the shelf, I have a random skirt and these are all of my pants. So all my jeans, my colored pants. Now I have two racks as you can see and this one I have this shelf and I have shorts here for now. And down here are some like bra pads. So yeah, I just keep those stored away. Not sure what should go there, but I will be unpacking stuff. So we'll see. Here are all of my blouses. So I have, you know, sleeveless ones and some short sleeve ones. And then it goes into long sleeves. Some of these are very unorganized. And yeah, it's just very unorganized back here. And then I have my skirts. And on this rack, I have some coats back there which need to be moved, I think. Some heavyweight sweatshirts or sweaters. These are, oh my gosh, some of these need to go. I have too many and I don't need them all. And then I have some nicer sweaters, like casual ones, loose ones, cardigans, I should say. And then I have dresses over here and some long skirts. And then this random pair of pants. And then I have my belts. 
When you look to the outside of the closet, I actually have a shelf right here. In these bins, I have swimsuits, and then these are undergarments, but special undergarments, like, you know, body, body centers, I don't even know <laughs> what to call them. And I have bags up there. Those are our hiking bags and my disc golf bag. So I'm not gonna go up there. First, I'm gonna take out all of the winter stuff because I'm not going to be wearing it. And then I'm gonna divide it once I get it all out. And a lot of this is going because a lot of it is sweaters. So the reason why I'm really making this big change in my closet is because my color palette is very curated now and I realize that I like to wear color and for a long time I tried to get into like wearing kind of basic pieces and I talked about that in one of my previous videos. I know the title was like a bit wild, um, kind of, you know, kind of completely but not really. Um, so yeah, I've realized that I like having fun with my wardrobe and I am just embracing the style that I like and not shying away from it anymore. And I'm not going to try to wear things that I may not um, feel comfortable in. And some things um, I have in my closet are old, so it's kind of easy to let go of. Like one thing that I bought either, I think it was last year, I invested in these two pieces by Aritzia and they are the tank top. I'm just trying to get them down right now. They are these ones right here. I have one that's long and one that is cropped. I forget what they're called, but um, I do wish I got this in a different color. Wearing a bra with these isn't exactly the easiest. So yeah, I definitely tried, you know, being more minimalistic with my wardrobe, like investing in jeans and investing in these Babaton tank tops, which are very nice, but they really don't scream my style and they're nice basics to have for, I know, certain occasions. So I am happy I have them, but um, I like a very cozy, lived in type of look. Like what I'm wearing right now, it's like very comfy and floral patterns and like this bralette. This is like all kind of a new style and all these pieces are new to my wardrobe and I realized that I love it. It makes me feel like my best. It makes me feel like me. So I'm basically getting rid of the things in here that do not reflect that. Hey guys, so it's been about a week and my closet is done. It is looking really fresh and it has all the clothes that I really enjoy. Let's head into the closet and I'm gonna show you guys how I have everything organized and then I'll go through my dresser. So here it is, and as you can see, it's nice and organized. I keep saying that word, I'm sorry. So over here, we have my pants. And as you can see, I don't have a lot of pants, and I love that. Here I have shorts, and these are my longer shorts. I have one more pair in the laundry. And then these are my short shorts. So I just put all those there so all the bottoms are together. Here we have all of my tops. Um, laid out and I did keep this here. There's not much in there because I don't want hangers Sticking out as you know when I walk in so I kept that there I'm gonna put my uniforms in that cubby, but they are in the laundry right now and here I have my work pants I have like a pair of jeans for painting and then this pair of joggers that has a hole and I don't care about them and then here I have bras and bra pads and then these are my swimsuits I got this box from home goods and I went for a nice plant theme it reminds me of you know herbology so for my tops I did break them up into color and type so as you can see I have like these are my nice tanks. Not many. I do want more. I really went through a big overhaul of my clothes in the past couple years. Here are my short sleeve tops. As you can see, I like to wear a lot of light colors. This green top is new and I love it. It's just so cute. And then I have my long sleeves. Kept a couple cozy pieces in there and some nice cardigans. I am really into Abercrombie and Fitch guys. Like I'm wearing a sweater that's from there right now and I'm just obsessed. And then here I have some more sportier type things. The back rack has a bunch of longer pieces. So over here I have some longer skirts. This is actually a pair of pants. Then I have all of my dresses. So I have sleeveless ones and then I have some short sleeve dresses into longer sleeve dresses. And then this is a matching set. 
and then my skirts and these lovely organizers and then some like covers I don't know what to call them just covers and just some sweaters and then I have some extra hangers back there and two nice dresses or three nice dresses I'm not sure where I'm wearing those but I'm obsessed with this it's so beautiful I have two pairs of khaki shorts. This box has also been replaced. This is my shapewear box. I said special underwear, I think, before, but no, it's shapewear for when I wear dresses. Looking from the back of the closet, I have a hook for my robe. I figure I put my white one here because it's cute. And then I still have my belts, and I just organize them. It's so hard for me to get rid of belts because they're so slim, and who knows when I will need this you know like i wear these things for very specific occasions so i might as well just keep them and up top still has bags my new shower curtain and some bed linens up there now we're moving on to the drawers which are kind of empty in some places because i need to do laundry but i'm really happy and kind of getting used to some of the different placements so let's dive in in this top drawer i have socks and underwear as you can see the beautiful paper that i put inside down below we have workout clothes so i have my bra tops that are nicely like folded in half and just stacked very easy for me to go through and find things and then these are the little tops and more t-shirt like things and the bottom one holds my basic t-shirts and sweatpants and workout pants moving on to the right side we have bras so we have bralettes this one it's not folded so bralettes little bralettes and regular bras this drawer has all of my fandom shirts i call them minus one ariana grande one and then down here are my pajamas so norm normally this is all pajama shirts and these are shorts and then these are pants. So that is it for my closet makeover. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, found it maybe inspirational. I encourage you guys to go through your clothes and clean up your closet, see what you are not happy with and get rid of it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you are having a magical day as always and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.